Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome to another episode of Candace in Color. Uh, this color is indigo today. So I want to talk a little bit about indigo because a lot of people might not know exactly what indigo is. And this is probably the shortest set of products that I have um, that I believe are true indigos. I only have one, two, three, four products in the indigo category that I deemed the best in my collection. Um, I have a lot of, uh, going through palettes, definitely have indigo type colors, uh, but that's what we have. So what is indigo? So indigo, I, I wanted to let you guys know, so we know Roy G. Biv, red, orange, yellow, blue, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. So <clears throat> I thought some inf interesting information you should know about indigo, where we are. Uh, it's indigo is obviously between blue and violet on the visible spectrum and it's a dark purplish blue everything that I looked up indigo is more blue than purple it's not a mixture of blue and purple in terms I mean well mixture but it's not like half blue half purple um, half blue half purple tends to be a little bit that tends to be where you get violet from so you have blue indigo violet purple does that make sense um, you know so it's uh, looking at the definition wikipedia <laughs> indigo is a deep and rich color close to the color wheel blue as well as to some variants of ultramarine based on the ancient dye of the same name um okay uh now indigo usually is refers to a color that's halfway between blue and violet violet is halfway between blue and purple um and thus indigo is one quarter purple and three quarters blue um the second definition is the original meaning of the word the color of the plant dye indigo all right so there is a name for a blue a purplish blue or a bluish purple it's called indigo with that being said i looked through my collection for things that definitely well that blue family but leaned purple that's how i just describe it in my mind they're blue it's a blue but it leans purple if you want to say purplish blue but there's a name indigo um and so i did this look happy thanksgiving by the way i'm filming this on thanksgiving so i did this look with the indigo and the out i, I really like this look um i did this because one i didn't want to do a monochromatic like an all indigo eye um, because I do have blue, a blue look. I do have a purple look coming. And I was like, all right, we got to get from them. Like it, they were going to mush together. Um, so I wanted to just showcase indigo as how you might want to compliment it and things like that uh, in terms of other colors. So that's what indigo is. So looking through my collection, I definitely have a lot of in indigo eyeshadows. But in terms of the best, in terms of the best, that's what we're sharing today. And I told you guys, um, I have three eye products and one lip product. I told you guys, I did not want to like uh, share a palette that only has the one shade of the color I'm talking about in the series because like well, why buy a palette just for one color but I gotta I gotta give you this I gotta give you this and the reason why um because I know there's a mini of this palette this is the magic palette by Juvia's Place um and in here there is a shade IFE look at it that's an indigo if I ever saw one it is beautiful, deep, rich, matte. Um, what I am, I'm wearing it on the outer portion of this look today. All that in indigo, all that, all that. That's what that shade is. We know Juvia's Place palettes are very high quality, beautiful pigmented shades. You get giant pans. I know this one, The this comes in a mini palette. So if you don't want the big, big palette, you can get the mini palette and that shade would be in there. Um, but definitely a beautiful matte indigo indigo shape uh, another indigo shade that I have you guessed it, it's from give me glow um, this one is called grapeness um, and it is a matte pressed pigment this looks really like denim blue also when I was reading it was like dark wash denim is what we call indigo um, so anyway this is a matte a matte pressed pigment and this is a definitely an indigo blue so some places or some some people and things call indigo indigo blue actually so i thought that was interesting when i was reading up on that um up on that shade i don't know where my webs are i don't know and then the eyeliner this is probably the fastest video in this series and then the eyeliner that i have um i'm wearing that today as well and it is the urban decay uh glide on liner the 24 7 in tornado i have a, a half half and half like a double ended one but this is tornado and it's definitely 
I think this might be half blue, half purple. I might be pushing it with this one. But these liners are absolutely beautiful. They are some of the best liners in my um in my collection. And so when I found one that's an indigo shade, I was like, definitely. This formula, ooh. formula is beautiful soft and creamy I've had these for years they still glide on wonderfully they last all day um, and they're absolute absolute joy to have in my collection so if you're looking for an indigo liner go with that um, I don't really know if I have I don't have any indigo liners from Colourpop or LA Girl the liners I've really been talking about this series um, I don't just know if they make those colors but Keep it open for a cheaper alternative. Keep my eyes open. And then finally, the lip that I'm wearing. I love this formula. I'm so glad that I'm able to purchase from this brand again. Um, and it is definitely an indigo. And it is definitely my favorite indigo lip product. And it is the KVD Vegan Beauty uh, Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Echo. These are on sale right now because you know Kat Von D is not with the brand anymore. Blah, blah, blah. We happy about that. Blah, blah, blah. So we probably can pick it up for like $5. Um, but these last all day. They are transfer proof. They are waterproof. If they're not going anywhere, they are matte. And oh my god! <laughs> when I tell y'all, like y'all know, I drop things. Like it's. I'm not trying to be cute. I'm not trying to be quirky. I really need to find out if I have a condition because it's insane the amount of stuff I drop. So, anyway, long wearing, waterproof, absolutely beautiful. It's very true to color. What you see in the tube is what you get. Um and absolutely beautiful so again I am filming that you'll check out my tutorial either before or after this video obviously of how I did this look this eye look um, and I did a get ready with me style just talking about some being thankful and things because so today is Thanksgiving although you'll see it much later than that but I love you all um, if any questions comments concerns about any of the products mentioned in this video feel free to leave it down below I love you all and I'll talk to you guys in the next one bye